And in saying that, what was really happening is five years from now, if no one's really building and no projects are moving ahead, then quite, um, we might just see a fair bit of condos um, that were not built or not considered coming on the market. Five years from now, we might see a shortage and there might be a disruption in how many condos are available. And I know in the last little while, they were struggling, struggling with the high cost of borrowing, struggling with, you know, the supply chain issues. And while some of those issues might be better, you know, the very fact that people are not working, they're not breaking ground on some of these projects, there might be a delay and therefore this will just ramp up our, um, our housing market um, lag even further, if you know what I mean.